Hey, I was just fixing the light right here. Uh, you've been watching Junction City Live. As you know, I'm trying to look like my idol, David Bowie. I think this is a shirt he would wear. And on to the main point, which is off the wall news. They're going to tell some very informative stories. So pay attention, kids. Junction City Live. We would like to again thank Little Mermaid Baby Fetus for coming onto the. <laughs> Mermaid Baby for coming onto the show today, and they are not punk. In our top story today, a high school student has been suspended for making rude remarks about a teacher on Facebook. He really should have thought this out more and made the comments where no teacher would see them. MySpace. <laughs> With 300,000 iPhone apps and 200,000 Android apps available for download, consumers aren't willing to tolerate apps that at first sight don't meet their standards. Maybe they should put the Angry Birds picture on every app or cover them in cheese and gravy. It's worked for KFC so far. <laughs> in a move that shows group buying is maturing into lifestyle niches, uh, Fab.com today announced its and uh, launched its big gay deal of the day. <laughs> Daily deals targeted to homosexual men. Just thought you'd like to know. <laughs> Britney Spears' short-term teasers for her new video, Hold It Against Me, seem to be building some buzz and getting her name circulated again. According to YouTube, the teasers have been getting good traffic despite their short length and building interest for the new video's release on Thursday. The only thing that would be exciting about these videos is if they were about her retirement. Oh. Ex jazz band, the mailman Carl Malone, put in his two cents about the, the resignation of coach Jerry Sloan. Um, not only were his comments shocking, but his speech ability um, has improved greatly over the years. Um, no longer does Carl Malone refer to himself as Carl Malone. <laughs> Experts agree that his ability has Im experts agree that his ability um, to speak has improved from a grade school level to a high school level by Louisiana standards. In case you missed it, Lady Gaga made her grand entrance at the Grammy Awards last night, being carried in an egg on the red carpet. Miley Cyrus later commented that I'm going to do the egg thing next year for sure. Maybe it will be a pink one, an Easter egg, and maybe my mom can carry it. Oh, Miley, no. I think that's already happened 18 years ago. <laughs> the Rock has announced that he will be making his return to wrestling. Rumor has it he'll be under the new alias, The Fossil. <laughs> HTC has announced at the World Mobile Conference that they will be releasing a new Android smartphone with a dedicated Facebook button. <laughs> Tech analysis anticipate a new mobile phenomenon, butt statusing. <laughs> also announced at the conference was the first smartphone with 3D screen, allowing you to watch 3D movies. Um, it's apparently very, very similar to seeing a 3D movie in the theater. So, we can expect that Yogi Bear should still suck. <laughs> Newsies is officially going to Broadway to lure theater audi audiences in the wake of a recent Spider-Man phenomenon, the musical. Producers promise that a cable holding a flying newsboy will accidentally snap each performance, la launching the actor into the audience. Oh, yeah. The Catholic Church has released an app allowing their members to confess their sins from iPhones. It's not really innovative since people have been doing that for, on Facebook for years. At a recent Republican rally, a Sarah Palin impersonator drew larger crowds than the real Mitt Romney. But to Mitt Romney's credit, he drew more crowds than a Dick Cheney impersonator, which was a cadaver with a rifle. <laughs> Incidentally, he was very good. In Kyrgyzstan, the government has decided to shoot over 10,000 stray dogs rather than building shelters for them as they had originally budgeted. In other news, Michael Vick, has, Michael Vick had another business idea stolen. Billy Ray Cyrus says that Miley's TV show, Hannah Montana, 
destroyed their family, pulling them apart. Billy, you know, I think that letting your daughter pole dance at the age of 14 probably pulled your family apart. <laughs> the world's longest kiss record was just broken, 48 hours long. That's one small lip lock for man and one giant embrace for mankind. <laughs> the, the race is on for Oreo to achieve a somewhat obscure boast, a Guinness World Records entry for Facebook likes. Oreo, you're already America's favorite cookie. Isn't that enough? <laughs> and our last story for the day is a computer called Watson crushed players on Jeopardy last night with millions of viewers. Who cares about 2012? The end of the world is nigh. Well, that's all the news we care to share for today. Be sure to check out Off the Wall Improv at 1030 on, in, on Fridays in Ogden and Saturdays in Draper. Once again, I'm Lindsay Garside. And I'm Brandon Garside. Thanks for stopping by. <laughs> It's time for you to get up off your couch and try a brand new vacation spot. Welcome to Hooper. Originally named Muskrat Springs, this is a beautiful place. Come visit all 11 miles of heaven with a variety of features including barns and farms to look at. It's a quiet, quaint, dank little place to vacation. So small it didn't even make the 2010 census. Truly get away from all the busy life and learn what it is to have a night on the pig, literally. The closest hotel is five minute, miles away, so you can make your journey, to, journey downtown in just minutes. By car, horse, pig, or try our latest free ride on a hooker, <laughs> literally. And remember, no stay in hooker, hooker is complete without a visit to the Redneck Stonehenge. Let's meet a local, Budeen Parson. Welcome, Budeen. Well, hello, how are you? <laughs> I'm fine. Now tell me, what is your favorite part about living in Hooper? Well, my favorite part about living in Hooper would have to be the food. We have many varieties of food, including if you go to the Smash, you can get a good grits and taters. Or if you can go to. You, can you speak up? I can't understand a word you're saying. It, go to the Smiths and you can get some good grits and taters. Grits. 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 Also, if you like, we have a hay field for hay playing. You can roll in it. What you is can, your favorite time of day to roll in the hay? My favorite time of day to roll in the hay would have to be high noon. Afternoon delight. <laughs> Yes, because you can also catch for the critters, try to catch critters, but be careful, you might get hay fever. Hay fever? Hay fever. Oh, I have another question for you. And what's that? What is the best thing about the locals here? The best thing about the locals here is that they're local. Yes, we established that already. Is there anything else? Well, you can always depend on them for a good, for a good Shooting at you, if you ever want some excitement in your life, just go in somebody else's yard, you'll get shooting at soon enough. You, you mean people shoot at people? That's here. what I said. Do you shoot at people? Of course I do. It's, it's, it's how you say hello out here. Um, I'm starting to feel very uncomfortable. Um, tell me something else before I hyperventilate. Well, you'll be, you'll be happy to know that there's lots of air in Hooper because you won't have to hyperventilate because there's lots of air. You won't need one of those plastic baggies to go <laughs> in because you are already have enough air around. Yes, well, thank you for that. Are, are Sir, we on the air? Yes, we're on the air. Thank you, please come visit Hooper soon. I know I probably won't be staying for long, but you can, Y'all come you. see now, you hear? Hey, my name is Chris Gillis. And you're watching Junction City Live. And yes, I'm trying to match my idol, Prince. I think he would wear this shirt and the eyeliner that I have on. And we're going to conclude this show with one more song from our favorite new band, Mermaid Baby. 
And as you can see, they're not really babies and they're not really mermaids, but they do sing a lot of good punk songs. Mermaid Baby, here we go. <laughs> Happy songs I write seem to make their way underneath the bed. Wish that I could call you up and tell you that I'm losing it. I need to tell you all about my Sunday. I know the meaning is, but I just love the chats we have. We talk about nothing and everything I need to. Now, do you love me still? Do you love me still? Honey, I've been trying to write for you. Every time I try, it all falls through. I don't know what to say. Every sappy song just makes its way. All the sappy songs I write seem to make their way. Underneath the bed, she said, I love you, I think. Underneath the bed, she said, it felt right, I think. Now do you love me still? Do you love me still? Honey, I've been trying to write for you. Every time I try, it all falls through. The songs I write seem to make their way. Honey, I've been trying to write for you. Every time I try, it all falls through. I don't know what to say. Every sappy song just makes its way. All the sappy songs I write seem to make their way. Underneath the bed, she said, I love you, I think. Underneath the bed, she said, it felt right, I think, underneath the bed. 